Hello and welcome back friends. Welcome to my channel Coding with Anand. Uh, today I am going to show you my new project that is basically developed in Angular and .NET Core. Basically the front end is basically developed in Angular JS and the latest version right now in 2021 November uh, whatever the latest version is I am using that one and uh, the .NET Core application has been used in order to develop the API so this is uh, uh, let me show you the source code and uh, here is my uh, backend code this is uh, basically uh, it's uh, something like a, a Twitter type of application where we basically create a new account on our glitters and uh, then we can log in and then we follow some friends and uh, uh, all other operations we basically do we follow tags uh, hashtags like that so i will show you each and every application so before going to this uh, i want to tell you that if you are new to my channel just subscribe and uh, uh, at the end if you have any suggestion or you want this project uh, with some modification slight modification you can connect to me uh, I can give you the source code with the modifications and uh, let's start uh, I'm starting the server because in order to uh, use the front end we need some API so once we start we can see that uh, our users are displayed here from the API so our API is in running mode and let's create a new account uh, if you can see then there is validations that are put it here let's see uh, I want to add I'm going to add a new photo pictures and uh, let's see the photo is from this one and uh, this is let's suppose uh, uh, not Anil but uh, um, Birjesh Kumar Birjesh Kumar okay uh, Birjesh at the rate gmail.com and uh, the contact number and uh, the country India and the password Anand at the rate 123 and uh, let's register it so user registered successfully message is shown now we can go to already registered uh, we have uh, birjesh at the rate gmail.com and the password if i provide the wrong password it will say invalid username and password at the rate one two three let's see login successful that's okay so here we are in our uh, main screen okay so this is something like uh, you can see uh, the playground uh, screen basically show you all the tweets that you basically need let's suppose I want to make a tweet hi there I am new here I like glitters it is something like Twitter okay that's done so you can see the name is displayed here and this edit and delete option will be available only to uh, those tweets okay I forgot to remove this kind of thing now wait 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 we can directly remove it mm -hmm. in the playground we have a dashboard in the dashboard we basically uh, upload data create tweet okay and uh, after subscribe this dot uh, model is equals to nothing okay uh, let's see uh, I am testing let's turn let's add one more thing oh not not like that uh, 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 uh. I have to see what I am using in the model dialog box. I am using uh, model dot content. So this dot model dot content is equal to nothing. Ok. 
okay so once it is over create comment okay let's see one more time test it again that's done fine now it's working so uh, i want to show you that if i want to add it now working hash anand hash working now let's update the tweet updated successfully now you can see fine so if i want to delete any uh, we can okay so this is how we basically perform all the operations now these are the other tabs let's see what happens these are the followers that uh, we uh, that follows me and uh, these are the follow uh, this is the list this uh, tab will display you all those persons list who basically i am going to follow so how can we follow this one so let's see we have to search and this search operation basically work on two ways uh, let's suppose i want to search anand so basically there is a person anand and there is post that contains this hashtag so this hashtag will be searched in this one as well so let's say and follow follow once we follow look at this and uh, if i want to search any other person let's say an and you can see let's say i want to follow this one as well okay fine and look there is a follow option so how the uh, followers will work and how unfollow will work let's say i want to unfollow this one it will unfollow me and uh, if i go to this one an an okay there are so many names rajni have the same photo sunny okay so we are following a uh, few persons we are following three one and uh, let's go to some other person's account let's say i want to go to anand a n n d at the rate gmail.com let's password enter invalid at the rate one two three i basically use the same password so if i am going to this one so you can see the virgis is my follower okay and what i am following look at this so let's suppose i want to use virgis virgis okay i am following this one log out virgis at the rate gmail.com and the password okay at the rate one two three actually uh, i have provided a security oh, sorry password check that there must be some number there must be Eight, eight characters in the password so like that a kind of thing is there as i already told you that uh, this edit and delete button will be there uh, only for those tweets and uh, whosoever i will follow the tweets of that particular particular person will be displayed here let's suppose i want to follow uh, a uh, i have i think i have worked on this one as well so let's see in the playground look at this the amit uh, tweets are also there so this is uh, the whole working of uh, this project this is a small project but uh, this is basically developed in angular and uh, the backend api is basically uh, .net developed in .net and uh, i am using basically entity framework as you can see that uh, there are some uh, classes that is automatically generated and the database of this project is basically uh, sql server and uh, the number of entities are there that contains dto are nothing but the data uh, transfer object and uh, the followers and tweet and users are the only three tables in this project in order to work in this one the greeters 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 and here is you can see only three tables are there that correspond in so this one so this is the working of whole project uh, you can see uh, i am following the dot net core functionality part the dependency injection is also there and uh, the photos will be uploaded uploaded to the server and we can see any of them look at this so this is the whole working of the project if you uh, have any suggestion for this project you can connect to me uh, you can suggest me in the comments and uh, if you are new to my channel just subscribe i will come again with my new project and uh, new ideas just uh, till then wait and watch my channel thank you very much thank you good day